So it's early evening and we have a lot of a lot of caterpillar poop. And I'm gonna go ahead and clean out this cage now that our monarch has gone to chrysalis. There he is. So I'd like them to have a little bit of a cleaner cage and you're supposed to actually clean the poop out every two, three days. And so I'm just gonna go ahead and do that because we want everybody to be in a healthy environment. So I'm gonna leave the camera right here. We'll probably do a speed up fast forward for you, but um, this way you could at least see a little bit of the cleaning of the cage and I'll show you the poop that I that gets pulled out as well. Here we go. show you a little bit of the poop. You can see those droppings right there. Um, that's quite a bit of poop. And so we're gonna just put that in the in the garden and use it as mulch. Up. Oh, so here unfortunately is a a caterpillar. This is another one we had. He definitely did not make it, unfortunately. He's pretty mushed up. Um, and there is a portion that don't make it. And so we're gonna just go ahead and put him in the garden. And right now I am watering um, the garden. I'm just checking for other caterpillars, which I don't see any. And I'm watering the garden right now, so I'm gonna just go ahead and run these. Um... Under, oh wow, that's a lot of people. has quite a few aphids on the bottom which I tried to get rid of before I put it in the cage and so these guys I'm just gonna run my finger over them um, that could be an egg I'm not sure so I'm gonna just be careful about it our caterpillars right there he's hanging on he's doing really good he's not minding the cleaning I'm gonna put him here just in case we don't want to fall There's another little white spot right there, see it? So I don't know if that's an egg or if that's an insect of some sort. So we're gonna let him rest and there's a lot of yucky, ooh, poop in there and whatnot, we're gonna get rid of that. water for this guy. Now milkweed is poisonous so if you get any on your hands you definitely want to wash it off immediately and not get it in your eyeballs.
So we tried to put a little dill weed in there, but it didn't do so good. So that's going into compost. These milkweed leaves, this one's still doing well. This one, not as much. So we're gonna get some fresh milkweed. And not as much yuckiness in this water, but we're gonna still rinse it out. I think we're all set. So I don't have a little handheld vacuum that I could um, vacuum up the poop as was recommended. So I just protected the chrysalis 
and turned it over gently and shook it out. Um, the caterpillar came off on the netting. This is actually how I saw him going up to get on the milkweed. And so now he's got um, a, the milkweed stem that I just cracked off of our regular milkweed plant is in the cup and it's gonna maintain that fresh milkweed for several days. This has been here now for, this is our fourth day. So I've got a new cutting um, and hopefully that keeps him full until he goes to chrysalis and until our egg friends that are upstairs, um, until our egg friends are ready to move in here. Now, the little caterpillars won't be moved in until he's pretty much in his final phase because they could very easily um, be killed by another caterpillar. He could accidentally eat them as he's eating the milkweed. So let's go ahead and take them back inside. Um, it's getting chilly tonight, so we're not gonna leave them out, even though we could leave them safely out of sunlight outdoors. Caterpillars, after all, do live outside. We're gonna take them in. And let's show you our four baby caterpillars. So you can get a full update. Little washing of the cage. Chrysalis is nice and safe. This guy's gonna go back to munching. And let's see the babies, how the babies are doing. Turn a little extra light on here. So we have one. There he is, right here. Two, there's three, right there, Sam. And I don't know if that's an egg. That wasn't our egg that was shaking earlier, but see any marks on this one. This is still clean. Where this one's clearly been eaten. But I don't see our caterpillar friend. Oh, there he is. There's number four. He was hiding out too. So one, two, three, four. We have the next, next round of friends that are coming in. I'm going to do a little spraying and clean the poop off of these as well put them to bed, and then um, we'll visit our friends again tomorrow morning, see how their adventure continues. Thanks for watching.